There is news that Ben Roethlisberger signed a two-year extension with the Steelers. However, I would like to discuss his former teammate, Le'Veon Bell. The Jets had some voluntary workouts. And Le'Veon Bell, after missing an entire season of voluntary and involuntary workouts and games for the Steelers, did not show up to the Jets' voluntary workouts. Now, I understand they are voluntary, but Jalen Rose, don't you think after missing an entire season, signing with a new team, that you would show up to every little thing that you can just to show your commitment to your new team and fan base? He already showed his commitment. He signed his contract. Boss move. You got to look at the position that he plays at running back. The wear and tear that is put on their bodies, in particular a guy like Le'Veon Bell, who's going to be uh, amongst the most used players this year, not only with carries, but with receptions out of the backfield. He's trying to make sure that he preserves himself. Oh, and please. so I don't take a big thing from him not showing up for the voluntary workout. Do Jaylen, you? Yes, I do. He missed an entire season. He spent it in Miami at the club while he was supposed to be playing for the Steelers. He signs to a new team. He's going to reinvigorate his career after an entire season off. And what else is he doing? Like, what else is he doing that's more important than showing up, just showing the coaches, showing the fans, showing the organization that you're committed to playing football after not playing football for an entire year? Just do it. It's not wear and tear. Oh, he's preserving his wear and tear. What do you think they're doing at these workouts? They hop on the treadmill. They do some stretches. They look at a little film. They work in some playbook stuff. They're not really working out. It's not wear and tear. He's just preserving his vacation time. Dog, you had an entire year of vacation time just for the fans. I know it's it's just like I know it's just like a it's just a gesture, but for the fans, show up, put some shorts on with the Jets logo so we can get those pictures. Like I really feel like he should have shown up for this. And I'm not just like overreacting being a media jerk about it. You this. are really overreacting. If, if I was him, I would have been there. That's all I have to you say. Are if I was him, I would have been there. If you I was said him, I would have been there times. on day one and I would have been there early. How many times do you hear about players showing up early and they're the first ones in and the last one out and they're working so hard and they showed up to every workout, voluntary, involuntary? That's what I want to hear about Le'Veon Bell. That's what I want to hear. That's you what I said want to hear, Jalen Rose. three times that he should show his commitment. You yes. said another three times he should do it for the fans. He did I'm really both. Good at this. He signed Point a contract. Okay, You're that's what he animal. did for the Jets. He signed a contract, which means when it is time to show up and it gets serious, he's going to be present. I would be there. I would be there. Moving on, Le'Veon didn't play last year because he kind of didn't want to. Well, uh, Carmelo Anthony didn't play last year because no team would pick That's him up. That's not true. After a short stint That's not true. With the Rockets. It ain't after that he didn't want to play. Rockets. It's that Pittsburgh didn't pay him, and he was I the understand. first guy to sit out amongst the franchise tag. I understand. And now, like the Larry Bird rule, there's going to be a Le'Veon Bell rule. Game changer.